We are leaving New York today. We've had a lovely, how long have we been here? Six days, we've had a lovely six days. We are leaving today, it's about 10 o'clock. Me and Lara have been downstairs for our breakfast this morning. Stephen stayed asleep and we brought him up some pancakes. He had pancakes in bed. We've just packed up and we are about to leave. We've got a long travel day. Well, yeah, kind of long travel day over to, well, down to Washington. We've got to get over, we stayed in Jersey, so we've got to get over from Jersey over to kind of Midtown, like 42nd Street where the bus stop is. We're going bus, Greyhound buses from New York to Washington. It's about four and a half hours ride over there so it's not too bad to be honest oh just oh that's it i just literally just had to click oh. checked in passengers one minute past 12. view e-ticket let's go i just want to show you the lobby of our hotel it's so nice first national bank song on I put my feet up and we just sing along and I can't help but feeling just loving this moment can we stay here forever I'm loving this moment that was our little journey on the path train done we're now over in Manhattan we've got to get from we're at 33rd the path only goes as far as 33rd we've got to get from 33rd we're going to walk up to 42nd Street where the bus stop is. This is where we come up, just by Macy's on 34th and 6th half. Stephen's trying to figure out the way to go, he doesn't believe me. I know, well I think I know, that it's that way to the train, to the bus stop. Stephen doesn't believe me. 42nd, Port Authority, 42nd Street. Yeah. Is it that way? Look, if this is 6th and that's 34th, that's 32nd. We have to be going now. <laughs> we keep arguing about the way. We're going to walk down Broadway. <laughs> you got me? Okay. Stephen's off. Oh no. <laughs> like you're just marching ahead. I'm going without you. I know the way. I yeah, lost. Hi, I have them Greyhound tickets to Washington. Do you know where? Uh, if you want to buy tickets, you go down these I've steps. got tickets already. Oh, good. Go to gate 64, down those steps, straight to the end, down again. Brilliant. Thank you very much. Yeah. 64, down there. What? I asked that man. Look, does it doesn't say gate. No, it doesn't say. Look, it says gate, C agent. Oh, it's not C. Well, the agent, me. Yeah, yeah. Gate 64, just down there. No problem. Right, gate 64, that way. Yeah? I'm not so fancy in upwards. No. We might not have to go. No. That was pretty, pretty easy. We're at our little spot now. Gate 64, Washington. There we go. Oof, we're on the bus. What? It's quite nice, and it look it's got plug sockets. You know what I did with my um. Mac charger. I thought there's no way they're gonna have plug sockets, so I put my Mac charger in my bag that I've put down there. Give me Mac charger. Yeah. Never mind. Good afternoon. Welcome to Parkland. I'm Matt Minnesota. For your convenience, there's a restroom in the back of the bus. Please just cash in. That's the rule. Work less than three minutes. Cigarettes, smoking, and alcohol beverage and discourse. This is a non-smoking concert in the restaurant.
Thank you. We're at Union Station now. We're just going to figure out our hotel. It's a little bit away from here. It's maybe about, um, about maybe like a mile and a half. It's not too far, it's like a mile and a half. And so we're just seeing whether we should get an Uber, whether we should get a Metro, or what we should do really. So I was just having a little look on Uber now. What? Oh, yeah. Yeah. $14. I think we're probably going to do this. Oh, well, I was $13.99. Look how pretty Union Station is. Well, it's wreaths. Stephen's just sorting out her. No. Right, we've got an Uber. We have arrived. That's where we're staying. Hampton Inn by Hilton. Oh, yeah. Around right this way. Oh, are you with me or... Oh, Lara's lost. What? Keep going, keep going. And then, this way. We're all checked in. Oh, it's a nice little lobby area. Look at this nice little Christmas tree. 210. Oh, it's <laughs> stuck. <laughs> Turn right. And then, shall I go in front of you so you can... Not that you can hear me, but... Oh, to, yeah, if you turn and then we'll see at the end. Whoa, the moon's massive. I can't get in. Then you've got the door. Oh, it's huge. Oh, Lara, and you've got yourself a nice <laughs> bed rather than a sofa, a sofa bed. If you can find it. Oh, nice. Oh, and like lots of pillows. Right, let's see. Let's have a little what's in here. Oh, that's like our wardrobe with iron and safe. You didn't need to what? You got more headphones. And then I'm assuming this. Whoa. What? It's huge. I wonder if this is an access. I think this is an accessible room. I think it is. We have just had a little relax in the room for half an hour or so and we are heading out on Lara's found them, like this walking tour, like this self-guided walking tour wow. to see all the um, monuments. That is what we're off to go and do. Look what we've spotted. It's the White House. Do you know I'm looking? And I can't help but smile. Do you know? Low hanging branch ahead. Don't hit your head. Yeah. Right, like the first, we've been walking for quite a while now. We're, we're about to start our little walking tour. The first memorial on our list is Thomas Jefferson, which is just up ahead of us. We're nearly there. Just loving this moment. Can we stay here? Forever. Look at all the construction work going on. We're just discussing as we're walking who the heck Thomas Jefferson was. We don't know. God, Lara. Don't know. Politics. <laughs> Open. Let's go in. Was he like the president after Washington? Maybe. Oh, look, there's the guy himself. The guy himself, yeah. It says to be quiet and be respectful. Whoa. Wow. It's huge. But inside it. We're gonna take let's take the elevator to the lower level.
Ooh. Lower lobby, I'm assuming. Oh, look, this is all, all info about him. There we go, we have done. What have we just done? <laughs> Thomas Jefferson. Jefferson. Thomas <laughs> Jefferson. Oh, don't. We are now. Next stop is Roosevelt. I've just learned. Little. I was just reading my little um, my tour thing. Roosevelt had four terms. I was like, I didn't think you could do that. But Lara says that you could before. You stopped it. And then they, they stopped it after. The they stopped it after Roosevelt. Four terms. That's a long time, right? Four, eight, twelve, sixteen. Was was for the max. I don't think there was a max. It wasn't the max. As many as you vote in for. It's always been here. Yeah, yeah, because it's a an electoral. Brought George. George, you mate George. <laughs> nice view of um, what's it called? Washington Monument. We have arrived. Franklin Delano Roosevelt, President of the United States, 1933 to 1945. Fourth term, 1945. It's like set out in different, in four different rooms, represent his different terms. He was only president for 14, 12 years. Because he died. In his last term, oh, he, he died, died in. in oh, did he? He died in 45. Ah. We have faith that future generations will know that here, in the middle of the 20th century, there came a time when men of good found, oh, where men of goodwill found a way to unite and produce and fight to destroy the forces of ignorance and intolerance and slavery and war. Was that him with his little dog? This is all still Roosevelt. Like red, colour, AD. If I was trying to read the braille on this monument thing, it doesn't seem to make a whole lot of sense. Electric. Electric. Electrific. Electrification. Electrification? <laughs> Honestly, this place is pretty scary in the dark. Yeah. Come and look, Stephen. Yeah, they, look, there's... I don't know who they are, but... Just, just turn around a corner and there's these, like... Statues just there. Looking at you. Yeah. And there's some people over here lined up. Let's go and see who these are. Look, that freaks me out. They're all standing in line. Next stop, Martin Luther King. Here it is, Martin Luther King Memorial. This is the newest one, done in 2011. Did you like, did you like my little bit of knowledge? What told you? The guy tall thing. <laughs> the creator Martin Luther King, so she's saying dream. <laughs> Darkness cannot. Oh, DRI, yeah. <laughs> darkness. Yeah, darkness cannot drive out darkness. Make a career of humanity. Commit yourself to the noble struggle for equal rights. You will make a greater person of yourself, a greater nation of your country, and a finer world to live in.
around. Pretty excited. Yeah. They don't, they're not around. They're not just knocking yeah, about, are they? They are. <laughs> no. You but go, if you drive next two hours, the next way. <laughs> you're going to another state. We're having an argument about. Is it around? <laughs> Do you it? But the next place we're going to is <laughs> the Lincoln <laughs> Memorial. What did they do then? I was explaining to Stephen that there's 36 pillars. Each one represents a state. But when, Link when Lincoln died, what? there was 36 states in the US. So there's 36 columns. It's just what made me understand. I, was, I, would, I wouldn't say around in the first talk. Okay. If you were writing in school, you would say there were 36 states around when Lincoln here it is. This is huge. How far, if you frisbeed your phone, it'd go into the tidal basin or whatever it's called. <laughs> Look how huge this thing is. Wow. Oh no, look, Stephen. The reflecting pool with. That's pretty cool. Let's go up high. Let's walk up here. Oh look! Wow, this is so amazing. Steven, yeah. Look at what films the reflecting pool's been in. Uh, oh look! Look above each um, column. Has it, got a name? it says Pennsylvania, New Jersey. Well, that plane. It's got, it's got the states. My son John, 1952. Whoa. Forest Gump, 1994. In this temple, as in the hearts of the people for whom he saved, the union, the memory of Abraham Lincoln is enshrined forever. Did you like that one, Stephen? What? Did you like that one? The Lincoln. Lincoln one. I was pretty impressed by that. What? <laughs> yeah. That was impressive. The Lincoln Memorial. The next one we're going to is just right in front of us. Vietnam. Veterans Memorial. Oh, three soldiers. All along these walls are names. Like tiny little names. See if you can feel them. I don't know if it's feelable. Yeah. So that's, that's like a name? Yeah. Oh. And then oh, maybe just ten goes, foot high. It just, goes down. just goes on and on and on. I wonder if I'd have to write all of them. World War II Memorial is next. Just right here. This is pretty big to be honest. In fact it's huge. tour of all the memorials. I had a really nice evening to be honest that was quite enjoyable. It's quite late now though it's about I don't know like half past eightish or something and we haven't eaten other than breakfast at the hotel this morning. So we're gonna we think we're gonna try and get a takeout pizza delivered to the hotel. We're about 15-20 minutes away we walk from the hotel we're gonna see if we can get a pizza. That'll be so nice. Pizza in the hotel and then bed. Yes, we finally placed an order. We had a 
few problems, but we've placed an order to come to the hotel. I'm looking forward to this. We got our pizzas. They're weird ass pizzas. They're like long things. Let's go and see what they're like. Open them up. These, we created our own because it was $10 to add everything you want. Like in England, you have to pay. Oh, that's yours. We added tater tots onto Stevens just to see what like tater tots. Are they like little, like little hash brownie oh, things? Oh, sweet. Yeah, they're like little hash browns. Okay. Like in a bowl. Yeah, so it was ten dollars, and we could add, like in England, when you have to, when you want to change something on your pizza, you have to pay like something like fifty p for every additional thing or something stupid. Whoa. Yeah. That's yours, Lara, because it's got extra cheese on. And then my, oh my goodness, wow, they look delicious. Mm -mm -mm. I'm so hungry. This is going to be delicious. Well, I wasn't that hungry until I've seen it. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I hope it's delicious. Mm. What was the balsamic? Like fig. fig balsamic. Oh my goodness. Mm. What well, is the smell? It's just horrible. You don't like the smell? No, I don't sit on your pizza. <laughs> that would be a disaster. It would. What's the verdict? Nice. Verdict? Delicious. Delicious. I've just gone through security. I've just had a bad thought though. That on the things it said bring photo ID. I've got my driver's license, but no one else has got anything. 